Title, Delicious Homemade Cheesecake Recipe. Easy Step-by-Step -step Guide. Introduction. Hey there, foodies and dessert lovers. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the wonderful world of baking with a mouthwatering treat that's a classic favorite cheesecake. I'm going to walk you through a super easy and incredibly delicious homemade cheesecake recipe that will have your taste buds dancing with joy. So, grab your apron and let's get started. Ingredients Close-up shot of the ingredients being laid out on the countertop. First things first, let's take a look at what you'll need for this heavenly cheesecake. Make sure you have cream cheese, sugar, eggs, sour cream, graham cracker crumbs, butter, vanilla extract, and a pinch of salt. Preparing the crust. Crushing graham crackers and mixing them with butter. Now, let's create the perfect base for our cheesecake. In a bowl, combine the graham cracker crumbs, melted butter, and a touch of sugar. Mix until it resembles wet sand. Press this mixture into the bottom of a springform pan to form the crust. Pop it in the fridge to set while we move on to the next step. Creamy filling. Blending cream cheese, sugar, eggs, and vanilla extract. Time to whip up that luscious, creamy filling. In a mixing bowl, combine the cream cheese and sugar. Beat until smooth and creamy. Add in the eggs, one at a time, and then throw in the vanilla extract and a pinch of salt. Mix until everything is well combined. Cut to a shot of the YouTuber pouring the filling onto the crust. YouTuber. Pour this delightful mixture over our chilled graham cracker crust. Smooth out the top with a spatula and give the pan a gentle tap to release any air bubbles. Baking and cooling. Cheesecake being placed in the oven and then being cooled on a rack. Our cheesecake is almost ready to dazzle your taste buds. Pop it into a preheated oven at 325 degrees Fahrenheit, 160 degrees Celsius, and let it bake for about 45-50 minutes, or until the edges are set and the center has a slight jiggle. Once it's done, turn off the oven and crack the door open. Let the cheesecake cool in the oven for about an hour. After that, transfer it to a wire rack to cool completely. And trust me, the aroma filling your kitchen? Absolutely heavenly. Finishing touches. YouTuber, we're almost there, my friends. Once the cheesecake is completely cool, spread a layer of sour cream on top. This adds an extra touch of richness and a beautiful velvety finish. And, of course, don't forget to add your favorite fruits on top. I'm using fresh strawberries and blueberries for a burst of color and flavor. Conclusion. And there you have it, a delectable homemade cheesecake that's sure to impress your family and friends. The combination of that buttery crust, creamy filling, and the refreshing burst of fruit on top, it's a match made in dessert heaven. If you enjoyed this recipe and want to see more delicious creations, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up. Thanks for joining me in the kitchen today. Until next time, happy baking!